Got married for a second time, which was another bad choice. You know, my mind told me, no, he's not the one for you, but my heart was telling me yes. He ended up on drugs and I did the wife thing, went to meetings, trying to show him that I love him enough that he can get off the drugs and stuff, thinking, well, if you love someone hard enough, they get off not a positive attitude because it doesn't work. I ended up having to go to crisis to get my bills paid because he messed up all the money. I had to let a vehicle go back because he took the money and I didn't have anything to go on. So he, um, I had to go get some help from crisis to get my bills paid in order for me to keep somewhere to stay. I went back there. I talked to the lady. She asked me questions, asked me how I can go about being able to help myself you know, if I ever get in this position again. And it was just wonderful. She was treated me like I was one of her family members. She was really nice to me. And I was so upset and so stressed out because we had nothing. This made me feel like, you know, there's someone that actually care about me. And when I left out that door, I remember like it was like yesterday. I went outside and I just cried. I just cried. I thank God because if somebody was there for me, I thank you. I appreciate you for all you give, for all you do. And I thank God for having somewhere to go to get some help when I need it. So thank you for giving back then. And thank you for giving now. And the people that come about after me, I'm more than sure that they're going to thank you as well.